Immunotherapy is really a game changer for patients with cancer. We've even seen cures in some of these patients where there were no other treatments before. My name is Michelle Krosgaard. I'm a cancer researcher and my laboratory focuses on using immunotherapy for some of the deadliest cancers. Immunotherapy uses the body's own immune system to fight the cancer. Although it's been extremely promising and has shown amazing results, it doesn't work in all patients. So the goal of my laboratory is to investigate why these patients don't respond and then figure out how we can improve the therapy so we can help more patients. My lab is a part of the Perlmutter Cancer Center within NYU Langone. What really drew me here was the possibility of the close interaction with the clinicians. We talk to them every day, we meet with them, and that gives a lot of possibilities for interactions and discussion of where these treatments are needed and how we can work together to really improve them. So although my lab does very basic research, it can be quickly translated into the clinics and be applied by some of the excellent clinicians we have at NYU Langone Health. I grew up uh, in Denmark in a small fishing village just outside Elsinore. My grandfather was a chemistry and a physics teacher and he got me interested in all this. He would always practice his experiments before he had class, and he always included me, and sometimes things blew up down there, <laughs> and other times everything went well, fine, but that's how research is. I am a mother of three, and I always tell people in my lab that it is possible to have a family and be a successful scientist. What my laboratory is doing is trying to find new ways to treat cancer using a therapy called T-cell therapy, where you actually use the patient's own immune cells to fight the cancer. One of our major breakthroughs was to discover a protein that can specifically be targeted on the cancer cell by the immune system. T-cells are kind of the policemen of the body. We engineer those T-cells to make them better at seeing the cancer. One thing that I'm particularly excited about that we discovered recently is that there are certain proteins that are displayed on the cancer cell that can be targeted by a T cell and it would only target the cancer but it won't target healthy cells. That type of therapy is very different from other therapies, for instance chemotherapy that attacks all cells in the body. So of course that has more side effects. These type of therapies in many cases actually offers a complete cure so patients can live normal lives and basically not have their cancers come back. <laughs>